I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for a moment of silence. Good morning, Prescott Badgers. I am Eric. And Tristan. For Badger Media. Today is Thursday, November 8, 2018. These are your daily announcements. Students, freshmen, sophomores, and juniors come experience CTE Day Friday, November 16, 8.30 to 1. Stop by the counseling office to sign up and get a trip permit. Limited seating, lunch is provided. Come explore the courses at the CTE campus. Sign up in the counseling office and pick up a trip permit. First, first come, first serve. Lunch will be provided. Hey Badgers, the Prescott Skate Stop contest winner has been selected. Here's a brief clip revealing the winner. Congratulations to Augie on winning the contest. Come enjoy Prescott High School's fall production of the female ver version of Neil Simon's The Odd Couple. This production involves two entirely different casts. We encourage you, as an audience member, to take advantage of the special offer to watch both casts' version of the show. Simply pay for one cast show and bring back your ticket stub to see the other cast for free. Ticket prices are $8 for adults, $5 for students with their IDs, and free admission to PSD faculty and staff with their IDs. Tickets can be pre-purchased at the PHS Bookstore, through the POSD online portal, and or at the box office 30 minutes before the show. We hope to see you at one of these hilarious shows. Come support PHS and the Theater Arts Department. And for club news, the launch pad. What about it? <laughs> it's partners with Prescott High School, and they're providing opportunities for students to engage in clubs and activities after the school day is over. The launch pad is a community organization that provides programming that is culturally relevant to teens in Yavapai County. Through this partnership, students are eligible to receive tutoring when needed and participate in programs of their interest. In addition to tutoring, students can take advantage of the mentoring program. This program gives students the opportunity to set goals and receive support as they seek to achieve success. Shuttle service is available. If you are interested in learning more, visit the Launchpad website at the link below. And today for lunch, we have a golden chicken corn dog, large barbecue chicken wrap, whole grain ham and cheese sub, ham, turkey, and cheese sub, toasted whole grain turkey and sun-dried tomato panini, meatloaf potato bowl with golden whole grain biscuit, and crispy popcorn chicken potato bowl with a wheat dinner roll, and seasoned corn, and all of your other daily specials. I hope the corn is whole grain too. I hope, I hope so. I hope it's organic. And for breakfast tomorrow, we have rich, rich. cinnamon glazed pancakes with syrup. Very, very smoothie. Very Ultra Power Cocoa Donut, Ultra. Trick Cereal with Graham Crackers, with graham. Golden Grams with Graham Crackers, golden. Cinnamon Flake Cereal Bowl with Cinnamon. Graham Crackers, and Hot Chocolate has arrived, and it will be in the Snack Shack starting today, so go get some. And now for our sports boys. Hey Badgers, this is Ultra Gamer Boy Hayden and Layton for sports. Track, sprinters, hurdlers, and jumpers. There are winter practices available for you guys on Tuesdays and Thursdays at 5 p.m. and on Saturday mornings at 7.30 a.m. Meet at the track. All right, gamers, now this is epic. There's a parent informational meeting for anyone interested in being, being a part of the Prescott High School League of Legends team on November 14th at 6 p.m. in the cafeteria. Go get that bread. Get more information on all upcoming meets, matches, and games at PrescottBadgers.com. And remember to join us next time for more sports information. Hey, we're back. What do you know? On this day in history, in November 8th, on November 8th, 1889, Montana became the 41st U.S. state. Wow. Interesting. Events on campus, the Prescott High School Air Force J. Rotsi is presenting the Veterans Ball on November 9th. It will be in the Prescott High School lobby from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. 
The intention of the wall is to honor veterans and their service to our country. The wall will include names and pictures of veterans. If you know anyone who has served and would like them to be included in the wall, in the wall, please send in their name, ranch, their rank, and where they served to the link below. And are you interested in learning more about Grand Canyon University and attending a campus visit? On November 27th, GCU will be sending a bus to pick up interested PHS students to take them on a tour of their PHS of their <laughs> Phoenix campus. Lunch will be provided by GCU. Come by the advisement office to pick up a permission slip and return it by November 19th. We can only take one bus, so first come, first serve. If you have any questions, please con contact your advisor. And now for a word from our administration. Prescott High School annually hosts foreign exchange students from around the world. This program can provide a great experience for our visiting students, for their classmates, and for their host families. Is your family perhaps interested in hosting a bright young person from a country like Spain, France, Taiwan, Norway, Japan, Brazil, Thailand, Germany, or Australia? Host families receive a monthly stipend to help defray costs. We have we have need for one host family right now and several for the 2019-2020 school year. If you are potentially interested, please contact Assistant Principal Clark Tenney for more information at Clark Tenney. All right, Clark .tenny at FrescoSchools.com. And for weather today, we have a high of 53 degrees, a low of 40, and it will be cloudy with a 70% chance of precipitation. There will be 10 mile per hour winds and 79% humidity. Now for daily Twitter poll. Yesterday's question was, are you registered to vote? The results are 11% voted for yes and 89% for no. I'm with you, 89%. Today's question is, who is your favorite main anchor? Go follow our Twitter at Badger underscore media and vote now. And fact of the day, the name of the oldest cow ever recorded was Big Bertha. She died... <laughs> <laughs> Big Bertha. She died just three months before her 49th birthday. Wow. Oh, that's sad. She's old. What an old cow. Lived a long life. Thanks for watching, Badgers. Join us next time for more news.